This is an ABC Action News tracking the traffic's update. Brought to you by The Wise Company. You can't prevent certain events in life, but you can prepare for them. How you doing everybody? I'm Chief Meteorologist Dennis Phillips. Here is the latest on the tropics. We're obviously pretty much historically at least in the peak of the Atlantic hurricane season. Sem September 10th is the day you look back at history where things are usually more active and boy, that's certainly the case this year. Now there's also usually an uptick in October. Almost always it's the Gulf of Mexico or the Caribbean because that's where the water is warmest and that's something we also have to keep our eyes on. Outside of that, Florence continues to track to the northwest, but we feel as though down the road this is going to become a threat to the Carolinas or the Mid-Atlantic. Seriously doubt it has any impact on the weather in Florida. I guess we never say never, right? Irma was supposed to go up here and ended up south of us. But at this point in time, pretty confident if anyone, if anyone is impacted in the U.S., it would be the Mid-Atlantic. But boy, things have certainly gotten active from Florence to a 90% likelihood of development here. That will be Helene and an 80% likelihood here that will be Isaac where they're going to go just too early to tell. I mean, some of the models are hinting that the southern one could go into the Caribbean, and that's obviously something we don't want to see, especially in the Gulf, if it were to go in that direction. But at this point, that is not in the forecast. It's more of a wait and see.